Good morning, hot dogs, and welcome back to the morning announcements. Hooligan Show, Latino Club, Battle of the Books, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Just one more day and it's Friday. Attention all FHS readers, Battle of the Books is back. Our local competition will take place on February 23rd and the Clinton County Battle will be on February 28th at the Public Library. If you have any questions or if you're interested or becoming a member of the Battle of the Books, please see Ms. Mrs. Hale anytime throughout the day in the library. There, will, there are coaches who are ready to have you join their team Get some friends together for a team and join the fun. You may sign up through Friday, December 17th. That way you'll be able to do some reading over our two weekend break. The Hooligan Show will be tomorrow at seven and tickets will be available at the door for $5 each. Prepare yourself to laugh, cry, and maybe find some love. Now to weather sports. What's up dogs? Happy Thursday. Today for sports, we have wrestling, girls basketball, swim, and more. To start things off, the wrestling team will be having their first home meet today at 6 p.m. facing the Western Boone Stars. Make sure you come out and support the wrestlers as they compete here at home. Next up, the girls basketball team will be traveling to Delphi later tonight to face the Oracles. Varsity will begin around 7 to 7.30. The swim team will be here at home later tonight hosting West Lafayette. The meet will begin at 6. Let's wish the swimmers luck. Last but not least, Boomer is coming to Case Arena. You're not Boomer. Coming to Case Arena. He will be here Saturday, December 4th for the Hot Dogs vs. Western Panthers boys basketball game. He will be here in the crowd during the varsity game throughout Case Arena. He will perform at halftime and will be out front in the lobby of Case Arena signing autographs and pictures during the third quarter. Make sure you come out this Saturday to support the dogs and watch Boomer. That's all for sports dogs. Make sure you have a teachable Thursday. Now let's send it to Not AV with weather. Thank you, Nelson. Believe it or not, this morning the temperature was 47 degrees, but it felt like the low 40s or the high 30s with the high wind. I'm not sure we're gonna see snow at this rate. Anyways, the high for today will be 58 degrees, then we'll go all the way down to 38 degrees. Just like this morning, there should be high winds all day, so it will feel much colder than it actually is. That is all for the weather. Now back to your ugly host. The crash meeting is today, so don't forget to show up. And remember, if you cannot show up, talk to Mrs. Johnson about it. The Indiana Latino Institute is hosting an event for teens on December 14th at 5 p.m. It is to gain experience in the following areas, health equity, advocacy, civic engagement, leadership development, and mentorship. If interested, please open the flyer attached to access the link and the regist registration. A happy birthday goes out to Elizabeth Pierce. Happy birthday, peep. For lunches today, we'll be having chicken smackers for lines one and two, and for lines three and four, pepperoni calzone. That's all for the announcements, hot dogs. Make sure you like, so share and subscribe for more like this. Um.